Everyone, please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Commissioner Bates had to work today, and uh, so we're going to try to do it with the telephone here. Dr. Vance, this is Judy Johnson. Are you? Can you go into a session now? Yes, I can. Okay. Uh, before I begin, I will let you know that we have a representative from WSAC, Channel 13, Channel 8, 11, as well as the Lincoln Media. Okay. The Lincoln Journal. Thanks, sir. Good morning, Commissioner. Good morning. And well. Good to have you back, Charles. Yeah, I had a good time, but I need to be here. He's got a good tan. <laughs> Okay, here we go, guys. This special session of the Lincoln County Commission on July 24, 2012 at 10 a.m. is now called to order. Members present is Merle Q. Clark, Charles McCann, President, Charles Vance, Commissioner, via telephone. The sole purpose of this uh, special session is to accept the resignation of Thomas Ramey, Jr. Um, you want me to read that into the record? You want to read it into the record? I'll just read it. I do have a letter here dated July the 23rd, 2012, addressed to uh, Charles McCann, President of the Lincoln County Commission, reference to the resignation as Lincoln County Commission. Dear President McCann, it is with a heavy heart and much regret that I submit my formal resignation as a member of the Lincoln County Commission. I'm not required to resign until the date of my plea hearing on August 8, 2012. But in my opinion, it is best that I resign immediately, as any delay on my part in resigning would impact the ability of likely independent candidates filing for my position. I do not want the good people of Lincoln County to be denied a choice in determining a new commission. My entire life, I have strived to make Lincoln County a better place to live and raise a family. And I'm very proud of my record, and I pray that it will continue to improve. Respectfully submitted, Thomas Ramey Jr. With that, I would ex entertain a motion to accept that resignation. So moved. I'll second. Again, all yes. Motion carries on the resignation of Thomas Ramey Commission. Is there anything else that needs to become before this commission? The only thing that I would ask uh, Commissioner Baines that you and I. Uh, uh, at, at a convenient time of yours, I'll be available that we uh, get together and talk about how we may want to proceed with filling this vacancy and uh, we have 30 days to do that and uh, also along that same note as I understand it uh, that the uh, executive committee of Democrat and Republican will have the opportunity now to put a name on the ballot come November uh, that would uh, serve out the remaining term of Mr. Ramey. So uh, 
I think we've got two issues before us. One would be to appoint somebody within this 30-day time frame of, of the commission has to fill a position up through the election in November. And once the election is certified, then the new person would take over. Uh, but in the meantime, uh, we need uh, to consider someone that would fill this position. So we just need to uh, be thinking about it and then decide how we may want to deal with that. <clears throat> any, any concerns you have along that line? No, I'm, I'm fine with that. As, as soon as uh, we can, we, we need to do this. Okay. Uh, and are, you, are we talk, are, Do you think that uh, uh, we're talking about maybe uh, appoint someone at the first meeting in August? That would be my thoughts. If, if you and I can get our thoughts together, and uh, uh, I know before, you know, we went through a process uh, of advertising and taking applications. But since this is only four months, I'm not sure we did that with the sheriff, but uh, that's the thoughts I, I was thinking. Maybe that if we could get together and come with someone uh, to appoint uh, uh, in, at the meeting in August, then we'd appoint them until the election is certified. But uh, whatever will work uh, would be all right with me, but I just hadn't, I've thought about it, but I hadn't had a chance to talk with you about it. Okay. Uh well, what we'll do then, just as, as soon as I get my schedule cleared out uh, here, uh, I should be available, you know, tomorrow or sometime shortly thereafter. Uh, I'll, we'll holler at each other and figure out what we'll do. Does that sound all right to you? That sounds good, and uh, I'll deal with it from there. And we'll get back together then and uh, work toward that. All right. Any, anything else before the commission on this issue? Hearing none, entertain a motion to adjourn this meeting. Excuse me. Stand adjourned. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Bye-bye. Charles.